I'm so excited about, you know. You can feel those happy vibes in today's video because today's video is a get ready with me video and I'm going to be transforming from this to a beautiful goddess. I'm joking, that was really weird. Anyway, there's gonna be a transformation. So I got my eyebrows done the other day. How little looky looky. I love them, they're the perfect shade. And then I also got my nails done and I just got this pretty pink. So the first step, by the way, this is the day before, I need to put fake tan on. Cause I am very pasty at the moment. Like I, usually by this time in summer, I'm just like this tanned person. And at the moment, I swear everybody is just pasty white people. I think it's the smoke and then all the rain. There just hasn't been enough sun. So I have to fake tan, which is really sad. I'm getting ready to go to high tea. Yes, high tea. I'm very posh like that. Joking, mum won it as a gift card. So the whole fam is going to high tea, you know? That's just who we are. High tea. By the way, I have a cozy top on. So first step, I just need to take today's makeup off. Actually, I should probably tie my hair up. This is me with no makeup, guys, if you were wondering. Okay, so I feel like everyone has this really funky tanning routine that everyone needs to know about, but mine is really basic. Pretty much, I just get the tanning mitt and I get the tan and I put it on. So I actually use the Bondi Sands One Hour Express Tan and the Bondi Sands Mint. Sometimes I use the Overnight Tan, but I think I'm actually gonna use the One Hour Express Tan and leave it on for about three hours because I like that dark glow. And by the way, I'm wearing an old cozy. I couldn't find a black one. And I'm so stupid, I just ate. So I'm like really bloated at the moment. Good idea, Millie. Eat right before you film a video on a bikini. Anyway, that's okay. Let's start. So I start with my legs because that's what I like to go the darkest. Okay, so next is my belly. because I wanted a dark glow and I feel like I'm going to get a dark glow now. I'm going to jump in the shower and I'll see you then. Ooh, okay, I just got out of the shower and I look atrocious right now. Like, my face is all red raw and, like, I'm breaking out from the tan, but it's okay. It'll be better by tomorrow. Anyway, I'm about to go for a run. And I really don't want to go for a run right now. It's the last thing I want to be doing right now, but I'm going to go anyway. And a lot of people will disagree with me with that, but I think sometimes when you are trying to achieve a fitness goal or if you're an athlete or anything, sometimes you really have to push your mental strength even if you don't want to do it. I feel like I have to change something up. I've been struggling lately with my training and I haven't been performing how I'd like to so I really have to 
change something. That's one of the things I have to change up, my mental strength. I believe I've always been quite mentally tough, but over these past few weeks, I've just been so down on myself and bluffing myself out of sessions or bluffing myself out of a race. And I know it's me doing that, but it's honestly been really hard and people don't realize, like if you're not an athlete or racing or anything, people don't realize how hard it really is to achieve those big goals. But because I don't want to go for a run, I'm going to go on an extremely long run. It's not about the time, it's just about getting through the run. I'm going to try and aim for like 7 k's or something. 7 k's, I know. Anyways, I'll catch you guys after I go for a run. Okay, <laughs> I'm back. <sighs> I did it and I feel so much better now that I've done it. I did it and you know what? It helps. It helps. So I did 8.17 k's and I did it in 40 minutes which is pretty good I mean it's not too bad it was really hilly and it's really hot outside but my eyes are stinging I have sweat in my eyes oh. Oh. oh my god guys look what I've done to myself can you see that <sighs> don't do that I'm so I sweated it off and now it's green. Ugh. Next, I'm gonna make my bed. To be honest, I don't make my bed every day. Sorry. Now I'm going to put my two favourite products in my hair. It's the Instant Treatment. Smooth and... I don't need to use the Blown Bombshell because Mum put a toner in my hair yesterday. So it's already looking very blonde. So I'm back in my pyjamas because I want to wait for my hair to dry. So I'm going to make myself some breakfast. By the way, like... I'm loving this turn. It turned out amazing. Okay, so this morning I'll be eating tonight I'll be eating no. corn things with this already smashed avo, cherry tomatoes and an egg. <laughs> You wish. Okay, so now I'm moving on to skincare, but first I always have to brush my teeth. And then I've got this headband thing, midget. I don't know what it's called. I just pop this on to keep the water out of my hair because it's the dry. Oh yeah, that looks hot. <laughs> this is what I look like after every time I brush my teeth. I really wish I could be one of those people with like really white teeth, just glowing, but that's not me, I'm just metal mouth. So to start off with my skincare, Grace Cosmetics have sent me a few products and I've been trying them out for a few days now and I love them. So I'll show you guys what I got. Firming cleanser. So I use this morning and night and it just keeps me fresh, keeps the panda bear eyes down after a long day of mascara. So pretty much I just apply it. I can't see anything. I hate this. When I take my glasses off, I'm just blind. I'm so blind. Apply it a bit to my fingertips and pretty much just rub it in in a circular motion going upwards. So it's got any bacterial and aloe vera in it which is really good because it stops my skin from breaking out well it doesn't stop it 
but it just reduces the redness. I get some warm water, gently wipe it off. Okay, so next is this hydrating gel. And I love it because oh, we love the hydrated glow. I pretty much just use one pump because it goes a long way. And it smells amazing. Hydrated sunscreen. Okay, so next is the moisturizer, my favorite part. Now you only need a little bit because it goes a long way. And it's very light and gentle, which is so good for my skin because I have quite sensitive skin from the chlorine and my skin breaks out quite easily. And then just do up your neck because Courtney Kardashian said it reduces the wrinkles. But go upwards, not downwards. Courtney! No, I'm not going to have wrinkles my mama. And look at that glue. You see what I'm saying? I'm saying that. Got a hair on me. Okay, now I'm going to put my contacts in because I don't want to be a blind watch anymore. I just want to be able to see. Oh my god, I can see! Okay, so now I'm going... Hey mom, say hi to the vlog! Oh my god, do you want to go say a nan and pop? They're here, they're in their motorhome. The one, the only nan and pop. And guys, this is my dog. Say hi, bully. It's the bull. So not awake. Oh hey! Oh <laughs> she's on the toilet. Look what she's watching. It's your gal. Say hi pop. Hi Mike. <laughs> Vlog hugs. I just did my skincare routine. Does it look good now? Mm, Do I look like a hard sister? Feel, does it feel nice? Yeah, it feels really nice. I love it. Pop, do I look like a hydrated sister? You look beautiful, Bella. Oh, thanks, Bobby. Do you want to try some? Yeah, I'll try some. Anti-aging, I'm telling you. You don't have anything to let all help. <laughs> this is the salon. I'm doing my hair myself. How beautiful you are now. Model, go. Oh, yes, sister, work it. Give me more. Come on, Nan. Oh. <laughs> I just did it super quick and really wavy because I don't want it to look like a formal pony. I just want it to be like I woke up like this kind of pony. So I'm going to try and convince mom to ponytail it because it's actually really hard. It's actually harder than you think. Three, two, one. So she didn't end up coming so I have to do it myself. Okay, so this is the final product, guys. Okay, so now I'm just going to spray it because I just want to buff it up a little. Okay, so now for makeup. I'm not very good at makeup, but I try my best. Super natural makeup because I can't do anything. Pow, pow, glam. And with natural, you can sort of never stuff up. So I use the NARS Medium Vanuatu Sheer Glow. This stuff goes a long way, so. You don't need a lot. Next, I do eyebrows. I use this L'Oreal Paris one, and I it goes a long way. So literally, just go boom, boom. I use concealer, and then over any imperfections. Then I get the tip of my concealer brush and this eyebrow brush and I just outline the eyebrow and bronzer blush and then for eyeshadow I use this Chi Chi Basic Instinct then I use this lip gloss which was given to me from my kindy buddy in year six love that still use it every day though okay there we have it hair and makeup is done such a poser 
Anyway, here's the back of my hair. I wanted to do my hair in a ponytail because I feel like I always have my hair up in beachy waves and I just thought it's time for something new, it's time for something different. Why not a ponytail? Is everyone ready for a big transformation? Three, two, one. But I need Beck in there to tie it up for me. <laughs> hey guys, this is Beck. Hey How guys. Do you want me this to tie is the, the famous chick. Do you want me to tie this? Yes, please. Okay, come. Just tie it a lot. She's famous, famous TikToker. Hey guys. Go follow her TikTok. TikTok. Is that tight enough? How many thousand? 45,000. 45,000. Yeah. Such a cute top. Oh, you got matching nails. nails. Yeah. yeah. It was from Bardo. You know how they're closing down? Yeah. Heaps cheap. I'm hanging them up with. So, okay, okay then we're well, Duncan and Graham with Stop! Jackson, stop. Jackson, you can stop. be funny, but you can't be rude. Stop! Right. Jackson! Alright, I want to delete that clip. Okay. <laughs> Ready? Smile. I don't know what's wrong with it. Gold earrings. I'm not going to wear a necklace because I feel like. Necklace and earrings with this will just be a little bit too much. And then I'm gonna pair it up with these white crisp shoes that I washed the other day, so they're nice and bright. Ah, and voila, this is the finished product. Have it all dressed and ready for high tea because you know we're those kind of people high tea so i hope you guys like this video if you did give it a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification bell on if you want to know what happened at high tea watch next week's video because i'm going to be vlogging and it should be fun because like the whole family's there because we never go out as a family like never i'm so surprised that we're all out together most of the time i feel like an only child so today i'm one of three yay anyway goodbye guys have a lovely day and don't forget to stay rosy your gal wheels is out mm -hmm.